Peach has come up with her uh, with, with her hand up. It's more of it. It's a little more of like can can Officer Casinger come up with her hand up? Okay, I wanted to take a second to thank everyone for coming here to East Martin Township today. Um, as you know, we're here to dedicate uh, and do the ribbon cutting for our new all-inclusive uh, playground. This was something that I know the Board of Supervisors here in East Norton and, and all of our staff have been looking forward to, to doing for a long time. Um, as you go through it, um, you'll notice the, uh, the rubber base um, is, is super protective from falls of, of various heights. Uh, it was something that was important to us, not only to make it all inclusive, but to make it safe um, and, and healthy for everyone. Um, you will see there's one addition. It is handicap accessible in every way, ADA. It's also wheelchair accessible. Um, there is There will be a wheelchair um, swing set that actually will take another week or two to be installed. But um, so come back and stay tuned uh, in the future. Those more um, additions to this uh, playground will be will be made. Um, at that, at this point, that I will take a second just to introduce um, the vice chair of the East North Township Board of Supervisors, Joe Gabanis. Joe. Thank you, Bob. Welcome everybody. It's a beautiful day. It's a beautiful township. You know, you see the banners up, East Norton Township, East Norton Pride, and we are proud of what we've done today. And, and I just want to take a minute right off the bat, and, and he's in the back there, but uh, I want to thank um, uh, Brett Stevens and his Public Works Department for all the work they've done. They put this park together themselves, and it, it's, it's a great feat, and they did a great job. Let's have a round of applause for that. want to say that uh, our chair, vice, our chairman, Ashley DePiro, wishes she could be here today. Unfortunately, she has to work, and uh, she sends her regards, and she, she, she'll she watch the video for sure, and she'll see any pictures. You'll see things on Facebook. She posts them right away, so uh, she won't be far from our thoughts. But I want to introduce the people that are here today, my fellow board members. Uh, we'll start with Dennis DeSanto, or DJ DeSanto, we'll call him. Uh, this is, um, excuse me, I have a little bit too much coffee today. <laughs> Jamila Winder, our, our newest supervisor. Kevin McDevitt. Um, and then I want to do some of the uh, officials that are here today. A former supervisor, and now our state senator, Amanda Capaletti. Uh, representing state rep. Matt Bradford yep, is Matt Brown. And Matt couldn't be here today, but the other Matt represents him well, so thank you. <laughs> we also have our county treasurer, Jason Salas, is here. And we have a Norristown school director, uh, Shay Ash. Um, I think that. Yeah, it was a great day. I don't want to dominate the uh, the microphone, so I want to open it up to anybody who wants to make a comment here. And I don't know, if State Senator, if you you have rank here, you can uh, <laughs> you can make a few comments if you want. Sure. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Joe. Um, as uh, Vice Chair Cavanas mentioned, I used to serve on the Board of Supervisors here at East Norton, and I remember when I first started with uh, now Chairwoman Ashley DePiro brought up the idea of an inclusive play playground, and I said, do you think the other board members would go for it? Several years later, here we stand with the support of this amazing board, the amazing staff of East Norton. Everybody jumped right in, and it's just a demonstration of the type of community that we have, one that is inclusive, that thinks of everyone, and wants everyone to have a place within our, our walls or our confines of East Norriton. So I'm incredibly proud to have served East Norriton in that capacity, to serve you in Harrisburg, and to be able to say that we have one of the first, if not the first, all-inclusive playgrounds in Montgomery County. So thank you guys for making this happen. I am truly appreciative to work with you 
as your state senator. Hey, thanks everybody for coming out today. It's such a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Uh, I, I just want to say that uh, thank you, uh, Amanda, for your fine words. That uh, she's right. It is an inclusive playground, and this is something that the board really was interested in having. And as you look around our park here, you can see with all the East Norton pride, this is what we're trying to bring. That East Norton is a place for all our residents to come to enjoy recreation. We have a great rec staff with Natalie and Brian, uh, so they can sign up for different uh, events that are going on. We have a whole list of events, and hopefully everybody comes out and you know, joins up. So thanks everybody for coming out, and enjoy the playground, kids. Good morning, everyone. This is my first public event uh, as a supervisor, so I'm really proud to be here. As an East Norton resident of more than 30 years, to see uh, the innovation and the commitment to play for all, and when we think about diversity, equity, and inclusion, this is the definition of that. So, um, really proud. I, I can't to claim uh, that I had anything to do with this, but I have a commitment to making sure that this playground is a de destination for all. So excited to have our East Norton residents at the playground and I'm hoping surrounding communities will follow suit and build playgrounds uh, like we've, we've built. So thanks to the team for bringing this to life. Uh, when I joined the Board of Supervisors five years ago, uh, one of the biggest complaints from my wife was that she had to leave the township for amenities and things to do. Um, we, have, we have moved far away from that and this is something that people are going to come to East Norton to see. Um, I just want to talk to the kids that are in the crowd. Um, uh, Mr. Hart, our township manager, said that you can fall and not get hurt. Uh, let's not test that equipment today. <laughs> no one throw themselves off the equipment, all right? Enjoy the park. I hope it's enjoyed for many years to come and I thank you all for coming. Thank you. A couple more dignitaries that are here that I want to mention. We have Don Ben here from Shriners Hospital. Uh, Shriners will use this facility and they, they will make good use of it. Also want to introduce one of our, and everybody has met her, Officer Peaches. <laughs> she's our therapy dog and, and she's a champion. She's She's kind of laid back right now, a little warm out here, but you know, she'll do. <laughs> but I want to thank everybody for coming. I'm going to turn it back to Mr. Hart here just to uh, wrap up things and uh, let you know what's what's the future brings here. And we have some more activities planned for today. So he's going to tell you a little bit about that. Thank you, Vice Chair. Us. If everyone would like to walk around, they elected some staff to walk around to the other side for the ribbon cutting. Yeah, uh, I'd like to say one thing that many people uh, used the word destination when they were here today speaking. Uh, if you talk to playground professionals, they will tell you this is a destination playground. And that's true. It is something that people will come for and why to use. But on behalf of East Norton Township, I want to say East Norton Township is a destination place and leading Montgomery County. So we encourage you to join uh, our community and make the most of it and, and see and be here for the new innovations that will be coming throughout this summer and into the fall. So thank you and uh, get ready for the ribbon cutting.